Hi guys, welcome to the latest video on how to make a Twitch chat box. Today we're going to look at the on join commands and the on part commands, which basically means that we can finish our point system to an extent that people can earn points, remove points, add points, um, check the points, and they'll basically earn the points every five minutes they'll earn one point uh, in the channel. So we're going to get that started now. So on the next line, after we've got our points add remove command, we want to do on exclamation mark. Um, Asterisk colon join. Now this is basically going to mean that in all the channels, because we've got hashtag, uh, which means all the channels, um, we're going to be doing a join command, which basically means when anyone joins the channel, this will take effect, whatever it, we put in the next parameter. So next line, uh, we need to do dollar sign plus open bracket dot timer points dot comma hashtag comma full star comma call sign nick close bracket now this is basically going to be the layout which it does uh, for our variable so this is basically like it does a time of points um, it times the points for our nickname so each individual user will have a different timer running which basically means that one person will join it starts a five minute timer for them to receive points and then if another person joins in that five minute timer they'll get a new timer which starts their five minute timer so this is basically how you make it unique we do a space uh, and we do zero which is what we want to start our timer at um, and then we need to put 300 because it's in seconds which is five minutes I believe yep that's good um, space app dot pts space call sign plus open bracket, hashtag, comma, full stop, comma, full sign, nick, close bracket. Now this is basically how it adds the points through the timer and how many you have. So basically if you want to add points more frequently you can change this value here. It doesn't really matter what you have this value of. Say if I want it for one minute I'd just put 60, 2 minutes, 120 and so on. Um, and that's all. Basically, I already set up the timer for that. Um, just let me make sure I've not forgotten anything. Yep, that's all there is to it. So, on the next line, we need to do add.pts space dollar sign plus open bracket hashtag comma plus comma dollar sign nick close bracket. And then we can close that off and that is that part done. So we can check the brackets, make sure that's all done and it'll align it for us. So basically I can now see, well I won't be able to see, but I've got two points and I'll gain points every five I'll gain one point every five minutes, just the one point. So we can go back into our remote now. And what I do want to show is when I earn a point, I want to know when I when I earn a point basically. Um, but I'm not going to show it when I earn a point because that's going to make the chat really spammy. I'm just going to show a message when people join the channel to know that they are now earning points in the channel. So we can do a message to the channel. We don't want it to be to all channels, we just want it to be to this unique channel. Um, so we do dollar sign channel instead of hashtag. Um, and then we're going to do a space. We're gonna, I want my message to be dollar sign nick, which means that it's going to be whoever joins gets a message so uh, it'd be cron tv has joined and is now earning points full stop now what i have mine set up like is so it says cron tv is now earning net uh, now earning points earn 20 points by subscribing to youtube now i've got that set up because i want people to be able to earn points from subscribing to my youtube channel because it'll bring more traffic to my YouTube as well as my Switch. So to do that, it is slightly complicated to set it up so you can earn points from YouTube from getting YouTube subscriptions. Um, so I'm not going to go into that this video. It will be a long time before we do something like that. But for now, we'll just leave it as that. Next line, we want to do after our close bracket, we want to do on. And we want to do the same thing, just again, but do part instead of join. Do the same, and on the 
sorry, on the same line, actually, uh, we want to do dollar sign plus after the, the colon after the um, hashtag. Dollar sign plus open bracket. And then we can do full stop, timer, points, full stop, comma, hashtag, comma, full stop, comma, dollar sign nick. Close bracket off. Now next line it needs to be alias minus one add dot pts space open screw the bracket write any minus n points dot any make sure you've got capitalization right of that. So this is bringing in our points dot ini file, which basically means that it's going to use this alias. Now the alias is set up in this command when it could be in this command as well I guess but we've set it up here because we've got our add points which is our new alias and that's going to be in, put in place here so this is basically going to be how it adds the points to our document so we've got our document points.ini a lot of people ask where is the points.ini file it is actually in your app data so if you do percent app data percent in your, in your search bar uh, we can see that we're presented with this. Now we can go to our MIRC folder. We can go to here. Just in our MIRC folder, we find points.ini. It's fairly straightforward. You can also find loads of other stuff, like URLs and stuff like that. Servers. You get the idea. You can also see that we've got MotionBots server down here and some other recent servers that I've been using as well. It's fairly straightforward. Right, so on to the next part. Um, we need to go and and write dollar sign one, which is like, as we remember, it's our sort of abbreviation. Um, space points, space dollar sign calc, and this is just going to calculate the points that it gives. So points dot i and i comma dollar sign i and i. Dollar sign one, sorry. Comma points. Bracket. Now this is how many points we need to add. We want to add every time zone. So, say if we wanted to add ten points every five minutes, we could put plus space ten. But I'm just going to leave it to one because I want to add one point every five minutes. And then I want to. Add, we can leave it there if we want. Uh, so it doesn't add a message, uh, but I want it to add a message at the end of each one. So I want it to be a message dollar sign chan dollar sign nick has left the channel and is no longer writing points. Like so. Very straightforward. So now what we could do is we could have a, add an if statement uh, stop the flood of the people leaving and joining um, now we want to just add the if statement I believe just to the message the, t the timer doesn't really matter it's still going to carry on the timer when they leave um, until that time is done um, but we could add a flood so we're going to copy our flood from here uh, just to make things easier and we're going to add it just before the message the line before the message and same on the part as well, we'll do that. Just so people can't spam collectively or just by themselves. So we want to check our brackets, make sure they're all okay. They are all okay. So that is basically it. We Now what we need to do is change the flood names. So we do flood join. Set of points. Flood join. Flood join. Join. And then I'm going to call these ones Part, for the part, 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 part. There we go. And that, that basically means so people can't spam and it'll create a variable to stop people from flooding in the chat. Um, so that is all there is to it, really. You can find these in the description. If you have any problems with them, please just look in the description. Uh, they'll be in a paste bin document. Um, so you'll find all this. I'll just paste up in paste bin that for you now. Uh, I'll actually paste bin the full points system right here, so people don't have to 
work it all out themselves if they don't want to, but I don't know. I just prefer to do it um, where we uh, where we do it all together. Where you figure it out yourself, because if you don't figure it out yourself, then you're not going to be able to make anything yourself. We'll copy that in there and submit that so I can put it in the description after this video. There you go. Uh, next video we'll be looking into the leveling system probably. Uh, or we'll go into the link posting system to stop people from posting links. I'll just do a small demo on that now. Um, we'll go into our chat. And in fact, we'll just leave the chat. And we'll do twitch.tv forward slash TV. Should be able to see. That when I'm a IRC registers that I've joined, uh, it does take some time sometimes, but that's just down to MIRC, or it could also be down to the Twitch IRC. It's probably more likely to be down to the Twitch IRC, but either way, I'll just do a little bit of a demo of this. So, points. See, so I've got two points still. Because we didn't have our remote in before. Just wait for that to register that we're in the chat. I'm back. It turns out that the Twitch servers, the Twitch chat servers are being a little bit buggy today, so the chat isn't working. Um, as usual, Twitch lets us down. But if you use the code which you even fo either followed through the tutorial or the pastebin in the description, um, Please like the video if it works for you. Um, also comment if you have any problems. Um, I do reply to basically every single comment, well at least I try to. And yeah, any problems just message me, comment, whatever. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz, and I'll see you next time.